Good afternoon, Paul and Stacy. This is Edit Good Life. Um, getting a video of that flagstaff taken for you guys that we were talking about Saturday that we couldn't get in. Um, <clears throat> so obviously this is the 529 RLKS uh, or RLK. Um, you can see it's got the frameless windows. Of course, it's got the front cubby that, that the fifth wheels will have that you know the travel trailers don't. It's got pretty good pass-through storage. I don't know how well you can see in there, but. And I don't know if you can see this, guys, but it comes with a, it's like a, it's a suburban version of a Blackstone griddle. And that just sits, uh, there's a little rail on the side of the camper. So that comes standard with it. Obviously, you get the solid steps. Uh, as we get back, you know, you get a nice big patio on him. Um, this is a little cubby and a little storage underneath the bench. And this one I was telling you about too, Paul. It's 100% aluminum framing. So a lot of manufacturers in that in that spot would put uh, wood frames, and this one doesn't. And then on these rims, I don't know if you see that green cap, but this actually has a tire pressure monitoring system. It's a it's a uh, wireless, and it's not just you know they let you know that they're losing air. This is something like a monitor you'd put in your truck, and it's both audio and video. This is that rail I was telling you about. You actually get a little table that sets on that, as well as that black stone griddle. Um, you could hook your TV with the bracket that's inside the camper. You could bring it out and hang it right there so you have an outside entertainment. Um, you've got the outside speakers, of course. Um, and then it does have its electric stabilizers in the back, uh, electric landing gear in front, and then you do have that receiver. Now, they don't give you a pigtail, um, but you do have a receiver there for like a bike rack. Um, so as we go inside, so when you first walk in, you walk into the kitchen. Um, nice big, nice big countertop. You get a double bowl, undermount stainless sink. Of course, you have the pull-out spray. Um, nice storage, nice cabinetry um, up above that. Residential poles. Look across the way, you've got a stainless steel microwave with your cooktop and oven. A huge residential refrigerator with the bottom freezer. And then this is kind of cool. So, and there, there's the doors. So when you walk in, you get a bench on one side and the two chairs on the other. And then you got that little divider wall at the counter. So as we come back into the living area, um, obviously on the rear wall, you have the fireplace, big TV, sound bars are standard. And then on either side, you have a trifold sofa. So those make into queen beds. Um, and you still have good walkway in between them so they do not come out and touch and then there's your theater seating and you get these little computer pads um, this also has ceiling fan as standard and this is a 50 amp service so it's got one air conditioner you could do a second um, you get your pan drawer down below good storage there with drawers uh, your pantry is right there and then as we walk up um, we come up into the bedroom and bath area so wardrobe slide you can kind of see it um part of that is for the bathroom and then part of that of course is for your bedroom you got a fairly good counter space good sink um of course your toilet corner shower uh, you've got a skylight above it you got a vanity cabinet um, above the sink another storage area up there and then you can go to the bedroom two different ways but obviously i'm coming in from the bathroom so there's your closet with mirrored doors. Um, again, good drawers there, countertop. Um, you've got a nightstand over there. You got 110 on each side and then USB on this side. Uh, again, with good storage up above. It's a residential queen, so it's 60 by 80. Uh, and then as we come back, come back out, um, you know, you can kind of see that whole living room and, and kitchen area. So it makes it nice because you actually, you know, folks could be sitting here and still have conversation with the folks in the back too. So anyway, I'm going to get this sent out. Uh, and I actually have a, a brochure too um, that I can get you guys. So we'll get that figured out. All right. Thanks guys. Have a good day.